welcome back to Wigging with Christy. I'm Christy, and today I'm bringing you a review part of the Two Girls and a Wig series with Denise, hey wig sister. Today I'm reviewing Inslee by Renee Paris and the Orchid Collection in color Chocolate Pretzel. Let's dive into this review. Okay, so Hey Wig Sister, Denise and I teamed up and sent each other a wig to review that we had not reviewed yet on our channel. And actually, funny thing about it is we are actually both sent each other wigs that we won. She won this in the Renee Paris co um, co contest and I won my Raquel Welch editor's pick in a contest. And I didn't realize that until we sent them. But oh my goodness, this is Inslee. I have been wanting to try Inslee so bad. And she is amazing. She's a lot of hair, a lot of hair. I'm just gonna say, it. I'm gonna be real with you guys, she's a lot of hair. But she's hair goals, like big time. Like, pit her up, go to a wedding, you're all set. <laughs> These curls aren't going anywhere. I mean, they are just amazing. I haven't brushed through this. I brushed a little bit in the nape because I was a little tingly in the nape. When, um, so I just wanted to kind of smooth that out just a little bit. Um, I don't know if Denise has brushed through this or not. I have not. We haven't shared our reviews. We're still both filming. But she is incredible. I love her. She's a lot of hair. I feel like wearing this wig, I belong in Texas, just where I want to be. So, you know, if you're in Texas, call me up. Uh, I love, love this hair. You can put her behind the ears here. She's so beautiful, guys. And guess what? She's an affordable wig. She's part of the Orchid Collection, which is a little bit more affordable collection with Renee Paris. And I'm in love. I seriously think I'm going to order me one of these. She's just a long, luscious, long, curly, uh, real regal, real elegant look. I really like her. So I went searching for some measurements and I found that she has a six inch bang. So she does have this bang here. So if you are a bang lover, you could actually cut in bangs into her. Okay, so all you bang lovers, because I know there's a bunch of you, you can cut bangs into her, okay? And I kind of crisscross that, but look how great she lays. She's amazing. She has a 13 inch crown and a 14 inch nape. I did have to search for the weight and I found that she weighs 5.64 ounces and I believe it. She's a lot of hair. When I first got her from Denise, I went and put her on real quick and I uh, went to my husband. I'll probably post a picture in here of me wearing that. No makeup, just some glasses. And I asked my husband, what do you think? And he said, whoa, that's a lot of hair. She is a lot of hair, but she's beautiful. Like, this is some major going out hair, date night hair, wedding hair. I mean, any formal occasion. She's just beautiful. You could do tons, tons of updos, which you know I've all showed you guys some with some clips, some pulling back, putting up. There's just so much you could do with her. I think she's really, really great for the price point. Um, I'm really impressed. Let's go ahead and do a spin. She's just so beautiful. I really, really like this. Um, she feels like she could get a little dry, so I'm going to recommend, as always, silicone silk spray. <laughs> Um, I can't tell you how much this has saved me on wigs that get dry. Uh, with, now with the curls, you want to use a wide tooth comb or your fingers, especially with this curl pattern. I would definitely do your fingers as much as you can. And then if needed, use a wide tooth comb. Some HD detangler spray or any wig detangler spray is really going to help these fibers as well. So you just want to make sure you take good care of them. They will get dry. This one is a little dry for my tasting, so if this was my own personal wig, I'd probably dose it with the silicone silk spray, but this is not my wig, this is Denise's, so I don't wanna to touch this for her, um, but it's amazing, right? Oh, it's, I love it, I love it. What do you guys think? 
Do you guys want one of these? Have you looked at the colors? What colors do you want that she comes in? Now I'm gonna to talk to you about this chocolate pretzel color and I'll probably show the color a little bit better when I show inside the cap. But this color is a medium brown base with light coppery auburn dark blonde and light golden brown highlights and dark roots. So it is a rooted look. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous color. I'm assuming Denise got to pick her own color on this and she nailed it. It's a really great color. Let's go ahead and take a look inside the cap. This color reminds me of almost Caramel Kiss by Stunica. Yeah, very close to Caramel Kiss. I would say Caramel Kiss might have a little bit more dynamic of the highlights. But this is a really close color to Caramel Kiss. Maybe a little darker, but maybe like the Caramel Kiss Rooted. I haven't had the Caramel Kiss Rooted before. So maybe um, this is closer to that color. It, it looks pretty close to me. I've only had the Caramel Kiss. But look at these luscious curls. She's beautiful. I really like her. I think I'm going to order her. <laughs> um, she's a great affordable price point too. All right, let's go ahead and take a look inside the cap. So she has a lace front and a lace left part. She has actually felt ear tabs and a felt extended nape. This is amazing with this collection and with um, Renee of Paris. I had the Envious from this collection and it was just the lace. It wasn't the felt. So this is actually a little bit higher step up in the Orchid collection with the felt ear tabs and the felt extended nape. She has the Velcro adjusters as well. So all those are actually some really nice features for Renee Paris. Because typically Renee Paris, even in their other collection, their normal collection, they don't do extended napes and they're usually bra adjusters. So I actually love this feature on this wig. Now let me talk about Permatisse. She does have some Permatisse in her, which I think is needed for this wig. Not an overdose, nothing I can see on top, nothing like protruding out. I think they did a really well job of um, laying her. But I mean, this is a lot of hair, a lot of hair but she's beautiful. I think if you're gonna have curly wig, you need a lot. Um, just, you know, that's my personal preference is if it's gonna be curly, it needs to be pretty dense, um, or then it's gonna look kind of thinned, right? So they just do a really great job overall with that body. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video, a part of the Two Girls and a Wig series. Today, the same day you're seeing this video, Hey Wig Sister Denise has posted her review of this wig. So go check out her video. I'll link it down below so you can see her review on this and how it looks on her. So I'm eager to see it. I can't wait. Can you? Go on over, jump over to see her video. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. I'd love to connect with you and have your support. If you have Instagram, I have Instagram, it's also called Wigging with Christy. I post there from life, kids, everything, hair, and in between. So I love to connect with you over there. I hope you guys have a great day. Don't forget to shine bright, love others, and be kind. I'll see you next time. Bye.